Okay, it's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from O'Hara's Brewery in Ireland and it's a collaboration with Star Hill Brewery in America and it's a bottle of their Foreign Affair Red IPA. There we go. Yeah. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. We've got a gold bottle cap. Whoa, nice bit of smoke in the opening. Now I came across O'Hara's beers. Here's their glass. They were kind enough to send. I come across their beers when they did a collaboration with Brewer Pinter out in Poland. I heard great things and I was really kind of interested on in trying their beers. So we got talking on one of the social networks and they were very kind enough to send me their range or a couple of their beers to review. So, beer in a glass, certainly looks like a red ale. Nice red hue to it. A little bit of a kind of a golden colour going on as well. Nice levels of carbonation, it's a two finger slightly off white head. 4.8% ABV. Oh, aroma, looking forward to this. Really good. Lots of, well, First of all, you pick up that it's a red ale. There's a certain, there's that lovely kind of toffee malt that mixes with the American hops that I just find delightful. A little bit spicy, nice and sweet, lots of American hops, a little bit of grapefruit, citrusy, a little bit of lemon. Oh, I'm gonna dive in. Cheers everyone. Wow, nice carbonation, nice level of biscuit malt in this beer. Oh wow, yeah, it's really, I really like them. I really like hops, I love American hops, but sometimes when a beer, when the malt, when the, the malt is pronounced as it is in this beer, as it's kind of pulling through and almost fighting back against the hop, it's a wonderful taste because it's a full on kind of breadiness. It's biscuity, it's, it's nutty. And that carries from front to back with the palate, from the front of the palate to the back end of the palate. You've got this really nice malty sweetness, this breadiness, this oatiness, this nuttiness. And then there's the hops as well. I've not even, I've not even allowed the hops to get into my mind. What I'm trying to do is concentrate on the malt at this stage, but now what you can do, you can flip the coin and you can see, right, okay, with a lovely amount of hops that are in the beer, let's pull some flavours from the hops. Okay, so an instant bitterness, a nice kind of grapefruity bitterness. It's... It, there's a little bit of tartness going on in the beer as well, a little bit of a kind of a jam quality going on. It's spicy from that hop. And then the bitterness, you're left with like a, a lingering bitterness on the back end. A very, very well put together beer. So both breweries really very new to me. Certainly Star Hill Brewery, not had any of their beers. Um, but O'Hara's, yeah, um, it's called Lublin to Dublin, the beer that they brewed with Brewer Pinta. So the city of Lublin in Poland, Dublin in Ireland, great collaboration, great beer, great beer. But as I said, this one for me, it's that really nice biscuity, oaty, bready, malty, kind of burnt toast, like a brown bread toast, you know, the kind of, the kind of malt, the type, kind of toast you get when you, when you're passing a bakery in the morning, you get that freshly baked bread feeling, that, that smell, should I say, but that really is, that really is 
the backbone of this beer is the malts and then you've got a really nice addition of hops in the beer and I like that I really like that in this beer it's a very good quality beer let's see if it's bottle conditioned I don't believe it is yeah it's not a bottle conditioned beer but let's give it a rating For all the reasons I mentioned previously, this beer, the collaboration Foreign Affair Red IPA, for me, it's a 9 out of 10. It's a 9 out of 10 from Reload Craft Beer. A fantastic, bready, biscuity, malty brew with a really nice hop finish. Thanks for watching. Put your comments in the comments box. Please subscribe to our daily beer reviews and cheers.